Okay, so I have this baseball tee. Did a t-shirt toss today for Irish Fest. I was hoping for t-shirts, got baseball tees. Not a big baseball tee person. It says a large, loose on me here. Sleeves are tight. I want to make it to a short sleeve. I have a short sleeve t-shirt, which I'm going to use to measure it with. I like the t-shirt, but I want the baseball tee to be a little longer. So I'm going to make it just above the elbow. So right over here, so I'm going to mark about an inch lower than that on the shirt. I'm going to do likewise on the other sleeve. I'm going to mark an inch lower. There's the elbow, a little lower. That's like that. That's about even. Okay, now we have the shirt lined up. Now I'm going to measure straight edge this far. Mark on the shirt the top, mark on the shirt at the bottom. <clears throat> Line up the other sleeve. It's not perfect. It matches. Mark on the top, mark on the bottom. It doesn't have to be perfect because the cloth will curl, but it should be within a quarter inch. Now, just cut. this piece, uh, put it on top of the other sleeve. Here we have a half inch variance, which makes me think that the shirt is further this way. So I'm going to cut along this, I'm going to cut right in between the two. That's about, about a third of an inch. Tapers off. I would take this longer sleeve. Whoops. Reconstruct the sleeve here. So it's even. Take the longer sleeve. Okay, I want to kind of cut just a little bit. I'm going to cut like this. I can even see how the sleeve is uneven. You'll see it in a second what I'm talking about. See how this was uneven? Now, I'm going to take the sleeve. I'm going to tease it hard. Cause the cloth to curl. Go the opposite way. Cause the cloth to curl. Take the other sleeve. Pull it up, to, up and down. Horizontal. Cause the cloth to curl. Now it's time to try the shirt on. Okay, I am now wearing the shirt. This is the sleeve where it's cut. And now just get it to curl up and just go like this. It's curled up. The other sleeve already curled a bit. It's kind of elbow length. Get it to curl up. It's the length I wanted it. At the bottom here, sometimes it goes like this. Um, you can just sew it together, or if there's two of these, just tie these two together like you tie a a shoe the first way and just keep tying a basic simple knot that will keep it from unraveling further but that's okay because unravels it just curls up so your shirt is now now I have a short sleeve baseball tee you see the shirt's been cut but if you look at the bottom part here it's made so it looks like it normally is cut so this will just roll up so you have the cut looking cut it looks like it's cut here it is cut here no one's going to care or tell the difference the only thing is not cut is this and not sure if I want to do that because if this seam unraveled, this seam will unravel. And it's probably best just keep this collar on. This is cut. Um, if you don't like how the sleeve looks, it's too too long. You cut like another half inch, like this one right here. I might just cut like here to get it to go a little higher. If I want to have something more like this, this is fine. It's baseball tee. It's not supposed to be a length of t-shirt anyway. It's supposed to be a little longer. Things are normally two thirds sleeve, but I can't care for two thirds sleeve.